Hey guys, and welcome back to the Minecraft video. And for this video, we're going to be doing the sixth episode of our superheroes mod. So far, we've done so many. Um, we've done this whole chest, and trust me, this chest was a lot cleaner. This is how it's supposed to look. Um, everything quite tidy in here, all the heads on this side, chest, legs, boots, and the same on here. Um, these are the ones I'm going to be showing you guys today, but in like other episodes, like the fifth episode we did, for example, X-Men, we did Groot from the Guardians of the Galaxy. On the third episode, we did Captain America with his shield. That's super cool. Uh, we did some superheroes on this first episode, like the Green Lanterns outfit, and then we did like the Flash, um, Red Hoods, all those crazy things. But Mark, as always, has left us a message. So it says, Dear Brothers, how was the last episode? Well, actually, Mark, it was amazing. I really loved it. We had this angel with like wings on it. It was so cool. It says, I have still got tons more outfits to show you guys today. So enjoy. Thank you so much, Mark. I can't wait to try them all out. So let's go and have a look. So this is our last episode here. Um, a little sneak peek. We're going to have an Iron Man's outfit. Mark 24 and Mark 20. They're going to be so cool. I can't wait. But first, we have to do these ones. So we have X-23's outfit and also Professor X's outfit. So this is going to be pretty... Um, well, some people actually really love the X-Men. I personally have watched all the movies. They were so cool. Um, so Professor X outfit, there we go. He's naturally in his position of having a wheelchair. So no matter how you wear this, it will always have a wheelchair. It's so funny. He comes with strength, telepathy, and a physic shield. There you go, look at us go. Does it do anything else besides this? No, nope, it just seems to be able to do this. So there we go. That is actually really funny because <laughs> we're just like going around in some wheelchair whilst everyone else has to walk. We are using this to the full. It does go up one block and go down one block quite easily. So let's take this outfit off and let's put on X23's outfit. It comes with strength three, speed four, acrobatics four, and regeneration. So acrobatics is basically you can jump and not have to go up certain blocks. It will jump quite a few blocks. So let's go down here and see how many we can jump. Um, so let's go up this one. Oops. You can almost jump four, which is really cool. So it should mean that, we, yep, there we go. We jumped up that one like jump in three blocks. That was so good. Let's see what we look like. Don't forget that I always have my mask on. My helmet does seem to cover every single face. I wish it didn't, but I guess there's nothing I can do about it. So let's go on this one here, which is our last one. Put these items in, and here we go. Deadpool's outfit, super cool. We've got the Scarlet Witch. So let's see what, the, I'm gonna put on the Deadpool's first. I would actually put on the Scarlet Witch first, but I'm gonna do the Deadpool. Here we go, wow. That is actually really like similar to what I expected. Um, let's see if we've got any weapons here. There you go, we've got the Deadpool's weapons. And as you can see, when you press X, it will take the sword off your hand and put it back on. It's so cool. I really do like this one a lot. Um, and let's see what it has there. Strength 3, Speed 4, Teleportation, Acrobatics, Regeneration, and a Physics Shield. I wonder how it does teleportation. You see? There you go. So it's exactly the same as basically if you shot an arrow. Let's just shoot up there. Wait until it lands. There you go. So if I shot an arrow over there, I'll have to wait for the teleportation to land and then we'll spawn there. There we go. We spawned. So that's actually really cool. I really do like this Deadpool one so much. So let's see what this Scarlet Switch is all about. Uh, let's see. We've got Scarlet Switches. There we go. Magic and flight. So let's see how we do this magic. Wow, this is, seems really heavy outfit. Like the cape seems to like drag on the floor like mad. Um, but let's see. Wait. <coughs> oh, that sound super scary. Wow, this one's uh, pretty cool. But obviously I'm a man, so when I'm wearing girls' clothes, it just doesn't suit me. So let's take them all off right quickly. Um, let's do Quicksilver. That's gonna be super cool. And Moon's Light. Wow, this is gonna be crazy. I can assure you that Moon's Light should have. Night vision. Let's see. It should have it. It doesn't. Strength to acrobatics. I just expected because of the moon thing, it should like have it, but it doesn't. There we go. We've got a moonlight staff. Does it do anything? Nope. It doesn't seem to shoot or anything. I wish it did, um, but I guess it's a good stick for fighting. So that's really 
cool. So let's see what we have next. We have, let's take this off, there we go. We've got Quicksilver. Uh, we've got Strength 3 and Speed. Wow. Quicksilver has definitely gotten quick. Let's see. Do we have anything? No, we have no special abilities. So these are the only things we have with this one. So let's move on into the next one. So let's put these on. There we go. Perfect. And we have Nemesis's outfit and also Loki's outfit from the Avengers. So let's take Quicksilver's off and let's do Loki. We've got magic, strength, teleportation, fire resistance, water breathing, flight, acrobatics, and regeneration. We've got a Chitarii uh, sword, which does come with some sort of attack, but it doesn't seem to be working for some reason. Um, and let's see what we look like. Oh, and look at those horns. This is really cool. I really do like this one. That is so far my favorite, just because of the way it looks and everything. So now let's do um, the Nemesis. And um, we got the Chitavi sword uh, in our inventory now. So let's put the Nemesis on. And we have slowness. Why do we want slowness for? Why is he so slow? And we got a scale. Wow, this sword. And whenever you put the scale on, it's a lot faster. Um, yeah, when you put the sword on, it gives you strength, speed for teleportation, flight, acrobatics and regeneration, which is quite weird, you know, that when you wear the sword, it gives you all those features. So, let's see. There you go, teleportation is R, um, which is once again, really handy, you know. Having all these teleportation objects are super cool. Um, so let's put these items back now, and let's see what we have here. There we go, we got the Doctor Doom's outfit and Red Hulk. You know, who doesn't want a Red Hulk? So let's put these items off. Red Hawk should have some crazy strength. Strength, speed, acrobatics, and regeneration. Let's see. Gosh, we look angry. Let's see. Pressing C will create a sound effect that is so cool and so strong. Um, and on the left there we have our health. And yeah, really, that's about it. So let's move on to the next one, which is Dr. Doom. Comes with magic, strength, teleportation, fire resistance, water breathing, and acrobatics. And the last one was a physics shield. Once again, let's see, let's press some buttons, see what it does. Gosh, pressing, pressing X seems to like blow everything up. That must be the magic is on about. And pressing C will teleport you. The only annoying thing is that all these outfits have different sort of key binds. So like the last one was R to teleport. But this one doesn't seem to do anything when you press R. So besides that, it's actually not that bad. I really do like this one, but once again, this is a villain, and I'm not a huge fan of these villain outfits. Um, some of you guys might be, but personally, I'm not. Let's do the Ultron's Prime uh, outfit, and let's take this off, there we go. And this will be the last one of our episode. We have Strength, Speed 2, Fire Resistance, and Flight. So let's see, let's press C, Gosh, that is sound is so scary. I'm pressing R creates another sound. So there's quite a few features on this one. Let's see what we look like. We do look like a crazy creature. And that kind of does actually wrap up this episode. So guys, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please post them below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you all very soon with another video. So peace out.